Hello everyone, my name is Pink MP3 Mochi, and today I'm going to talk about how to get subliminal results. Subliminals are messages that are being sent to the brain below the conscious mind. Subliminal audios contain messages and voices on low volume repeating affirmations. Your subconscious mind and conscious mind are different. For example, the conscious mind has a limited capacity to hold and process a feeling, thoughts at a time, compared to the subconscious mind that can hold a vast capacity of information to process. If the subliminal messages go through the subconscious mind, it can fool the brain into believing the affirmations already exist. Thus, the mind and body will begin to act accordingly to those thoughts. A great example of this would be pseudosciences, when a woman believes she's pregnant when she's not, and her body begins to mimic the signs due to the mind perceiving that it is. From this example, we can see how powerful the mind is. So, listening to subliminal audios should give everyone full results. Now, let's talk about the 5 reasons why you're having trouble receiving results. But before I explain, I would like to say that there are rules to using subliminals. The subliminal community's beliefs and mindsets change yearly. You're free to believe whatever you want, but in my opinion, the reason many sub-users aren't receiving results like back then is because of all these new beliefs that are clashing with your subconscious mind. Now, let's talk about the 5 reasons. Number 1. Opposite mindset than affirmations. If you're listening to a subliminal for clear skin while having acne and saying the opposite of what those affirmations are repeating to you, your negative thoughts can interfere with your results. If the audio repeats, I have clear skin, then believe it, even if you don't see it. Always repeat the positive affirmations and not negative. This can create confusion and blockages to your subconscious. Number 2. Inconsistent listening. Subliminal audios are to be repeated more than once like the submaker has mentioned. However, there are once a day listening subliminal audios which contain different affirmations usually many repeated at once or a single affirmation that would repeat to you daily. If you can listen to your subliminal audio every night or every day at 3 p.m., make time on your free hours or minutes. A good schedule example can be that if you're only available to listen Saturdays and Sundays from 8 p.m. to 8.30 p.m., listening only 30 minutes. Have a routine schedule for listening. Number 3. Your beliefs can be why you're not getting results. Remember when I said that the subconscious mind can be tricked easily? The subconscious mind absorbs thoughts and messages smoothly. When you first start subliminals, not a single doubt goes through your mind. You try it out because you believe. So, if you're a user for longer, why suddenly do you have doubts on what you can manifest? We should shut down the thoughts and mindset that we need subliminal audios sped times 100 and bundle 10 times to get results. You don't need to do all extra steps like visualizing 33 method or scripting. Just listen to the audio for however long you like consistently and you'll have results. Number 4. Bad Affirmations The subliminal community can be spooky if you know what I mean. There are users out there who intentionally put negative affirmations in the audios you listen to, preventing you from results. Not only negative affirmations, but the use of black magic and negative energy can also be transferred. It doesn't matter if the subliminal maker is popular or not. A great way to check if a subliminal is safe is by increasing the volume of your device and listening to the affirmations underneath the sounds or checking the comment section to see if many users have received results. Number 5. It's actually not always our fault. Another reason why you're not seeing results is because your subconscious mind is rejecting the affirmations. Imagine your brain like a computer. The computer can have files that are corrupted. The subconscious mind can become confused. Although it's smart and perceives vast information, it still has its cons. So how to reverse this effect? Listening to a flush. A flush is a subliminal audio that clears the subconscious mind of blockages, clutter, and clashes. Imagine your brain like a computer. The computer can have files that are corrupted, which clashing is when two affirmations don't mix together, for example. You are listening to a subliminal to get a flatter brow ridge. Yet the subliminal you're listening to another subliminal with high brow ridge also, this creates confusion. I don't know where the mindset of clashing doesn't exist comes from, but I believe when we put our emotions into science, it can cause error. The subconscious mind can become confused. Although it's smart and perceives vast information, it still has its cons it doesn't work every time. 
A flush is a subliminal audio that clears the subconscious mind of blockages, clutter, and clashes. A flush usually contains affirmations like remove the effect of all subliminal audios that I listened to that had conflicting affirmations, remove blockages, clutter, and clashes, remove any old subconscious beliefs that interfere with my results, and many more. A flush only clears any bad affirmations that you have listened to, clashing affirmations, etc. When you use a flush, please make sure to not listen to your other subliminals. Your subconscious mind is in the process of restarting. It's best if you only listen to a flush. You can listen to a flush 3 to 7 times until you feel that all bad affirmations are removed from your subconscious mind. Number 6. Self-sabotage Many people have a negative mindset and constantly focus on not getting results, feeling disappointed before getting results, or simply not believing what they're listening to. They always think the worst outcomes and then claim subliminals don't work. Remember, the subconscious mind absorbs thoughts and messages smoothly. When you put in your negative thoughts, the subliminal won't work. You'll have a constant loop of not getting results. The trick is to always be positive, even when you aren't getting results, and to always believe in your affirmations. Even if you don't believe at first, your subconscious mind will start to believe, and the subliminal will work. You may not feel the results immediately, and you may not even see the results, but believe in the process. I'm sure you'll be able to see results soon, and that's all the reasons why you're not getting results. Hopefully, I was able to help. Now let me explain how to get subliminals to work. The first thing is to stay consistent. Subliminals take time to work, and listening to them just once most likely will never be enough. Most people see small results within the first week of listening to subliminals, but some people may take longer depending on their beliefs. The second thing is to keep a positive mindset. When listening to subliminals, avoid thinking negative thoughts and always remind yourself that you are getting results. Even if you don't feel the changes in your reality, your subconscious mind is still absorbing the affirmations. The third thing is to drink plenty of water. The body needs water to absorb the affirmations from the subliminals. The fourth thing is to avoid negativity. Try not to read or listen to negative things while listening to subliminals, as they can negatively affect your mindset and results. And finally, the most important thing is to have faith in the process. The mind is a powerful thing, and with time and consistency, the affirmations from the subliminals will manifest into your reality. Don't give up! The mind can be tricked easily, and that's the basis of subliminals. The brain can perceive subliminal messages and beliefs below the conscious mind. Subliminals contain affirmations that our subconscious mind will perceive and manifest into our reality. The most common way to use subliminals is by listening to subliminal audio files with affirmations, but there are also other methods such as writing affirmations, visualizing, scripting, and more. The best way to use subliminals is to listen to them consistently, as repetition is essential for results. Some people may see results within a week, while others may take months depending on their beliefs, so it's important to be consistent and patient. Subliminals manifest into reality in different ways, but the main way is through the law of attraction. As the affirmations change our beliefs and mindset, which in turn attracts the desired results into our reality. It's important to be consistent with your listening. Listen to your subliminals at least 1-2 times a day for at least a month. Consistency is key, as it takes time for the affirmations to sink into your subconscious mind. The more you listen, the more the affirmations will become a part of your subconscious beliefs. Also, it's important to avoid clutter and negative affirmations in your subliminals. Remember, subliminals can be powerful tools in manifesting our desires, so it's only natural that we need to be mindful of what we are listening to and make sure the affirmations are aligned with our desires. Yes, listening to a subliminal at night can be effective. While you sleep, your subconscious mind is active and receptive to the affirmations, which can help the affirmations sink into your subconscious faster. You can also listen to subliminals throughout the day, and it's recommended to listen to them for around 30 minutes at a time. Subliminals are a great way to reprogram your subconscious mind and manifest your desires, but it's important to be consistent and patient with your process. I hope this video helps. Thanks for watching Dovies! Don't forget that a flush is a subliminal audio that clears the subconscious mind of blockages, clutter, and clashing. I've mentioned how a flush can remove any bad affirmations that you have listened to and how it can clean up your subconscious 
mind from blockages, which allows the mind to more efficiently manifest your results. The flush also includes many powerful affirmations for positive mindset, removing old negative beliefs and self-sabotage, and removing any old subconscious beliefs that interfere with your results. Listen to my flush whenever you feel like your negative thoughts are dominating your beliefs and it will help you clear all the old beliefs and thoughts that are no longer aligned with what you want to manifest. It's important to regularly use a flush to make sure your mind can effectively manifest your results, so make sure to listen at least once a week. I hope this video helps and gives you the best subliminal results you desire. And remember to listen to my flush, it's linked below.